So this is a very strange article and it's from the Dallas Observer and the whole point of this article is to point out that Quentin Tarantino is a sweary movie director. There appears to be little other value to this article other than pointing out that Quentin Tarantino produces movies in which the characters swear a lot. That's all this article seems to show. So here it shows a graph of the most common swear words used in Once Time Hollywood and then Reservoir Dogs and then Pulp Fiction and it just continues through all of Quentin Tarantino's movies identifying and counting the swear words that he used the most and I won't use them because you can get banned and suspended for it on YouTube but The Hateful Eight and Django Unchained perhaps there's no surprise what word is the most popular in those two movies but then here they have the total so if you are interested in this for some bizarre reason you want to know just how popular the swear words are in Quentin Tarantino's movies you can go through this article and find out in detail but like I said this article is very bizarre and particularly the introduction so it says here they call journalism the fourth pillar of democracy and while it can and should hold powerful individuals accountable the profession hasn't exactly answered one question that is truly on everybody's mind how many curse words do each of Quentin Tarantino's movies use so I think it's very tone in cheek article but I'm really surprised that someone spent their time doing this some people out there might be interested but for me this is too over the top this is going too far in trying to analyze the role of a director all it does is identify and record how often his characters swear and it doesn't really show anything I can't see the point of this article so the whole summary is that Quentin Tarantino is a sweary movie director and even the photo is a bit creepy. It's a weird photo. And it's perhaps not one of Quentin Tarantino's best photos or poses, should we say. So I'll leave a link to it anyway. If you do want to know which movie Quentin Tarantino swears in the most. Or what swear words he uses. I don't really know why. But it's a very bizarre article. And if you are interested in finding out how you can actually be paid to watch movies. And make money from something you love doing. I'll leave a link also to this article. And it will explain how you can be paid to watch and review movies. So you can be paid around $50 to write a review and a long form article is around $90. So if you do two of those a week, that's an extra, say, seven or $8,000 a year in your spare time doing something you love doing. And there's also got ways that you can actually be paid to review movies at cinemas. So I'll leave a link to this article and if you want to find out how you can actually be paid to watch movies, this will be really interesting to you. So if you have any comments or questions, please also leave them below and also like and subscribe.